What I'm showing you here is kind of a layout of three different plates that were shot. There were two different kind of plates. The plates here on the left is a monolithic plate. It is one piece of ceramic. The two plates over here are called mosaic style. They are two inch tile pieces that are adhered together and they together they form a number of tiles that cover the strike face make up the strike face that cover the UHF WPE backer. So you can see the difference. The, all three plates indicate a, a 30 alt six or M2 AP armor uh, piercing round going through the ceramic. So what you can see, what I wanted to show you is how a monolithic plate in the handling of that projectile and the damage associated with it is different than the mosaic tile arrays. The mosaic tile arrays, when they're done correctly, when the tile are adhered together into the strike face, and when they are uh, adhered to the backing material properly, these tile limit the pass-through damage of the projectiles far better than a monolithic style plate. Now, what does a monolithic do better? Well, you can see this is the, the wear face. This is the back side of the strike face where it meets the polyethylene. And this is a monolithic plate. And you can see that the, in layman's terms, you can see that the, that the ceramic uh, spalls off the back here in a much better way than the, than the mosaic does. Now, and the reason for that is that the mass of the plate, it's all one piece. And so this, this comes off more around the projectile. The energy pulls, breaks the tile away, fractures it away in a conical pattern. And it just, it, it more of the mass uh, comes off the backside when it, uh, when the projectile goes through here and it spalls off. So you get a resultant lower BFD on the first shot on a monolithic. But uh, the, the cons of it are, are the, of course, that the, the monolithic plate unpredictably cracks everywhere. And so you don't know when the next shot goes in if it if it if it's going to have if it's going to go into one of these thinner areas out here surrounding uh, about a two inch uh, uh, radius around the uh, projectile entry point or into one of these major cracks all along in here. So um, I took a black marker and traced the cracking in here so you can see it. Now compare that with the wear face or the back side of the strike face on a mosaic tile strike face and you can see very little other than the main tile that was hit you have very little spalling off the back so you have much better resistance to a close shot coming in here on a ceramic plate with a mosaic pattern you can also see the strike face here you can see the limited damage one tile one two inch tile versus versus this and you're looking at about four inches here so it's it's a definite difference between the mosaic and the monolithic obvious difference and I wanted to make the video just because a picture sometimes says a thousand words and you can clearly see that in a multiple hit environment over a period of, of t testing time, you can see in the data where the, the mosaic plate is more resistant to multiple hits. Now, let me just say this though, because I've been messing around with ceramic body armor for almost two decades, but you can defeat now a ceramic plate, whether it's a monolithic or a mosaic, you can still defeat them 75% of the time by hitting within two inches of the initial hit entry point with the same projectile. So if you come in here within two inches of the initial point, you're going to probably go right through it with a second shot. And the same thing here, uh, where the tile is completely damaged. Now, if you get outside of here into another tile and the backing and the bond is still good between the backing material and the ceramic, you can still resist with a mosaic style plate. But if you want to defeat a ceramic plate, you hit within the two inches of the first round with the same projectile, you've got a 70-75% chance of a pass-through. So that's, that's the downside to these. 
but you can see that this ceramic, the mosaic especially, can be very resistant to multiple hits.